Alright guys, so right now I just finished editing. Before I get into this video, I have to quick to tell you something. But if you're going to click off of this video for some reason, whatever the reason is, go to the very end of this video. There's some cool footage that I thought you guys might like to see. We saw this on the way back. I cannot show you because I want you guys to see. But this is all I'm going to show you. That's it. Well, I don't even know if you guys saw that or maybe you did see it a lot. But that is pretty much it. I had a ton of fun making this video, um, and I hope you guys enjoy watching this. So that is it for now. Enjoy this video. Peace. All right, guys, we just got back from the beach. We got, I forgot to show you guys this new hat. I freaking love it. It's really cool. Alaska. It's camo. Got nice breathable back. Anyway, now I got that a couple of days ago. I showed you it earlier, but yeah, I don't have that footage. Anyway, got back from the, what do you call those shops? Just roadside shops? Yeah. We got a few things, souvenirs, things like that. Got these rings. No one cares. Okay. Uh, I do. But it's still raining out, so I'm gonna have to put you guys away again. Yeah, there's a lot of rain, so. That's just pretty much an update. I mean, to, wait, what day is it? Is it Friday or Saturday? Saturday. It's supposed Sa to rain the rest of the week. Saturday. We're going halibut fishing again Monday, so stay tuned for that. Tomorrow, no idea what we're doing. We are Absolutely. In Homer right now. Absolutely no idea what we're doing. Yeah. yeah I just, I, to, from here on, besides Monday, I have no idea what's going on. So just stay tuned for more exciting film. So, that's pretty much it. Alright guys, this boat is really cool. It has this whole system right here. This is touchscreen. It's a Garmin. Garmin. This is also a Garmin. I don't know how big this is though. I'm guessing like a 12 inch. That's probably an 8 inch. Or a 10 inch and an 8 inch. I'm not sure. But that's really nice. Shows depth. We're in 186 right now. Really nice system. It's got an under bed yeah, down so here. You guys can't. Yeah, there you go. It's got a nice bed storage right there. Got a nice anchor winch, windows here, plenty of room for seating, plenty of room. This boat is absolutely gorgeous, so I'm gonna get back to fishing so I don't miss out. Stay tuned. We just got out here. I will show you footage, but I'm just gonna do this first drop. I'll show you on the big camera just some stuff. But we're doing the same thing, same guy, same boat. 100 pound braid, big Shimano reel. Like 180 feet down, two pound weight, big circle hook, and big chunks of herring. Oh, yeah, that wake you up. Yeah. All right, that's what we're looking for. Butt on the boat. There he is. Got him. Alright guys, this is the second drift. So far we have two, one keeper, but we've caught three dead. Caught three, one keeper. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. 
I got a collar. A little one. <laughs> you got a bike. You got a bike. Yep, there he is. There he is. He's on here. That's small. Is that lid? Yeah, that's a. Uh, that one you could fit in your your toaster oven. Like a <laughs> like a pop tart. Like a pop tart. He barely has eyes on both sides of his head. Holy cow. He sucked. Yeah. Well, it's actually a lot harder to catch fish that small. You know. Yeah. Sammy, I believe you are hooked up with our neighbors around the boat. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're all kinds of wrapped up. Oh, yeah. Nice. Thud. God, was meant to Oh my god! That's adorable. Oh, so you're gonna get into some trouble here? Because you're binding up on the side of this wheel? No, no, you can. Just every so often take your thumb and walk down. Um, uh, let's drop you behind Heidi. Heidi, I'm going to get you to come around this way. And I'm going to get you to slide around over here. I'm going to do a full halibut shuffle. Uh, I'm going to have both you girls slide two steps to your left. And you're going to drop it right here. I've caught three little ones. Tiny babies. Do you remember your colors on your line? Third drop, I've caught four, no keepers. Four. Brandon's caught None. zero, Dad's caught two keepers. That's it. Actually, I got three. You did get three, you get four. Three. Stop trying to steal your brother's fish. Jeez. That fish is not like it. Same free. Yes, sir. Hi! Oh no! Yeah, he was. He was. That was great. Okay, come in your way. No, I did have one. You did. You totally had one. She totally had one. Oh yeah. Oh, well, I'm always having a tea party. Let's go. Doubles, triples, quadruples. Rain's gone. Yeah, just keep going. Keep your rod tip up if you can. Put it. Keep going. There you go. Okay, thanks. Good. Now just keep. Yep. Put it right to the side. Did you side. get a good hit? High? I had one. Come on. Bad. Why are all my so little? Here, just wait. Here, just give it. Bring it up to me. Look at that cute little thing. Okay. Bye, bud. What? Did you just thank him? Yeah. Give him a pat on the belly. Here, give that weight. Oh. Come on, man. Ooh. Come on. Off. I'm gonna spray it. You need more bait. See, Jordan, that was your, it was your baiting job. That was all your fault. Oh, was it? Yep. I know, I saw that monster you just brought up. 
I got color. A good size one. A good size one. Small. Blur. Ooh. Time is it? Is he just gonna slip out of your hand this time? Yeah. Just accidentally. That's a 15 minute fish. That, that, yep. I agree. That means that I say, okay guys, 15 minutes. If it's a halibut, it dies. Gotta wait for that 40 pounder, you know. You know. So, yeah. Alright guys, so here's the rig. Well first we'll start up here. We have a big swivel connected to a hundred pound braid. And then we have a barrel swivel connected to this like it is leader line, but it's more of like a rope. And then there's a knot and a swivel. Stop not stopping the swivel with a two pound weight. And then we got about two feet more leader line. And then you have a big circle hook right there with part or a whole piece of a herring. And that's what we are, have been using and catching them all on. And then we have this rod. It's a Shimano rod. It's only 5'8", and it's really stiff, which is really, really surprising that it's so small. Then we have a big Shimano reel with 100-pound braid on it. So it's a really powerful setup for getting down deep. All right, guys. We almost have limits. We have. We need two more fish. We're holding out, hopefully for a bigger one. We're going to go to a different spot that's like 280 to 350 feet. We were in. Yeah, it's a one. And hopefully we can get something better, which we're still getting some fish. I've caught six. Rain's got three. Mom's caught none. Cause but she hasn't. She's been more watching. Today? Oh, mom's got one today. And dad's got like four. So, hopefully we can go get some good ones, bigger ones at the other spot. Stay tuned. First time this whole, this whole trip, both trips I set the hook. Yeah. I'm not kidding. 300 and... 260, 61 feet. Yo. Got color. Okay. Ooh, in, must be in the sand. Yeah, light color. Very good looking fish. Oh, We're taking that one. Roger. I think you'd miss him if you threw him back. Yep. Okay. Oh, he's a big one. So I believe we need one more. That I believe that makes you guys the first overachieving group. One. Yes, Dad's hooked up. Oh. Oh, jeez, that I don't think those lines are pissed. Bottom? Now, what would this Were you at the bottom? What is the potential? Event? Yeah. You guys were at the bottom? Yeah. Oh, shit. Oh. The potential for these are silvers or rockfish. <laughs> that's an awesome fish. Oh, wow. And that's a oh, monster like that. Oh, and what? That's a monster tiger at that. I I don't know that I've seen one that big before. Did you break? New Alaska right? Uh, no, I think I still got it. Yeah, that thing is awesome. Uh, have, you, have you heard of a yellow eye? A yellow eyed rockfish? The one with giant pumpkins? So this is a non pelagic species. It's just like a yellow eye. Um, but yeah, I've, I mean, I've caught tons of tigers. That's easily one of the biggest ones I've ever seen. Good job, Dad. That's awesome. Is it edible? Oh, hell yeah. No, they're delicious. Oh, they're delicious? Yeah. Oh, yeah. That in, right? oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. You're, allowed, you're only allowed one per person of those. That's so cool. Good job, Dad. Yeah, good. Excellent job. Excellent job.
Um, will you hold on to that for a second? I'm going to get a picture of that. One. <laughs> <laughs> that's, it. that's always fun when you're. Uh, oh, I remember that. You have one? Yeah, you have one. Yeah. Yes. Oh, that's good. Uh, I got one. Dad, I got one too. I don't know what it is. Nope. The gold silver. No, I'm just kidding. It was that down at the very bottom. No. I lifted up into him. I'm, I'm, he ate it on the fall. You also have a rock. That is awesome. He's got one too. Right over a pile of them. Yeah. So we not quite what we were targeting, but uh, yeah, here, let me have you hold this one. So this is a juvenile yellow eye rock. Uh, no, I mean, that's nothing wrong with it. It's a huge, like, sort of rockfish. That's a big rockfish. But the actual yellow eyes get about three times the size of this one. But I just wanted to do my own. That's pretty cool. I got one, too. Oh, sweet. Yeah. Oh, he's barely hooked. Awesome. Oh, wait, wait. I need to get my camera. Uh, so I'm getting one back on there. Bonus dishes. Alright guys, we limited out on halibut and caught three extra rockfish. Here they all are. This uh tiger rockfish. Oh it's not even tiger rockfish. And then this I don't even know, it's an orange something, something. But we got all Ten halibut and then three rockfish between all of us. It was a very good day, very fun. Thank you for watching. Peace. Oh, are we ready? You're not going to count me off or anything? We're okay. ready. Uh, my name is Captain Jordan. I run the Crusader here for Central Charters in Homer, Alaska. Um, we do half days, full days, salmon, rockfish, uh, ling cod. Then if it swims, we'll kill it. Uh, we'll go out, take people, uh, depending on the types of trips, you know, 20, 40, 60 miles out. Uh, some days we catch our target species and we get bonus fish like today with uh, with our crew that we had. Mr. Reese was down there whaling on halibut and decided he got bored from catching so many. So we, we dropped him down with a different rig and, and he pulled out this big big little yellow eye. So uh, it's always exciting to, to pull up something you're not expecting. And uh, yeah, it's, it's a really hard job. I have to go out and fish every day and, uh, and, and talk to people and, and kill stuff. So it's just, it's miserable. Pictures are horrible out here. You'll never come to Alaska. There's just mountains and volcanoes and, and wildlife everywhere. You'd probably rather stay at your office and look at a computer screen. Um, but yeah, if, if, you know, if you can get past all those terrible things I just said and you want to come up here and fish, uh, Central Charters is great. And you can ask for anybody in that company and we'll, we'll take care of you.
All right, sounds good. Thanks a lot. Yeah, you got it. Appreciate it. We had a good day. We got all limits plus three rockfish. That was all good. Thanks a lot, Jordan. Anytime, yeah. All right, guys, we are done with the fishing trip. We're back at the RV. Um, it was an amazing day. We caught three rockfish, bonuses, and then we caught our limits on halibut. All pretty much the same size. We caught four over, no. Yeah, four over and four under under the size limit. The size limit is 32 inches. So you have to keep a minimum of one per person under 32 inches. The rest can be either under or over. We need a minimum of one per person that's under 32 inches here in Homer Spit, Alaska. I don't know what the regulations are for anybody anywhere else, but um, yeah, it was pretty fun. I think we had to go out 29 miles. So yeah, it was an hour, tri hour ride out there. Um, that boat was pushed by two 300 Suzuki's so that we called up I think we were going 40 miles an hour um, that whole trip so an hour of driving um, it was really fun we caught those rockfish on it was called a diamond jig we limited out on or my family limited out on um, halibut so he was like here you can throw this we threw it down, we got two rockfish, and it's just this big lead weight that's in the shape of a diamond. Um, and you just jig it up and down. So that's how we caught those two. Um, but it was really fun. You guys should go come to Homer Spit and check them out. And if you guys want to go with the same guy, his name is Jordan. Just go to go and request him, his name, and his boat. It's really nice. Um, I, I hope you guys liked it. I had a blast. My whole family had a blast. Whoa, almost fell there. But thanks for watching. Make sure to stay tuned. I do not know what else what else we're doing. It's going to be kind of just moseying around the rest of the time. We have to return the RV. Um, and then we're going to Anchorage and then we're going home. So I, nothing too much more exciting. But thank you guys for staying in tune, watching the rest of this Alaskan trip. Peace. He's got sh shoulder shoulders along the back. That's insane. Oh, yeah. <gasps> he got a fish. Yeah. Look at the cup right there. Stop moving me. Sorry. Where's the cup? Right there, there. Oh, here's one. <gasps> yeah, get on the other side of this. Thing's huge.
Grain, come here. Look at my camera. Look at go on the other side. It's a big head. They can catch more fish than you can, Dad. No, that thing was ready flayed. I seen it on here. Oh yeah. Reese, Reese. No, it says charge, so it's at low battery, but... Where's the third one? 